when you come to my house and i ask you smooth or crunchy i'm not talking about peanut butter but i'm talking about mulaga podi now each home makes it as suit their recipe and i find that the store bought mulaga podi is extremely smoothly ground and sometimes really really spicy and because i can't handle that kind of spice i like to make it as per my taste and liking so it's really simple and very few ingredients uh, we're going to start by roasting uh, some sesame seeds first and as soon as it pops we will remove it onto the plate so as you can see the sesame seeds are popping i'm going to remove them onto the plate After this, I'm going to dry roast the chili. You'll get all the ingredients and the proportions in the description below. You just roast them until the chilies are crisp. So I'm just dry roasting the chilies till they are crisp. I'm just adding a few drops of oil to help it crisp up a bit faster. And removing this on the side. Again, I'm going to add a little bit of oil. Add the chana dal, which is the Bengal gram dal and the udad dal. Now we'll have to slow roast them until they are golden, and this will take some time, at least six to seven minutes. So we have to be a little patient. So after roasting all the ingredients, we have ground separately the red chilies, the sesame seeds and the dal. So now I'm going to just put everything in the mixer for one last time and pulse it together so that uh, you know it all comes together. So I'm just adding all the separately ground ingredients to the mixer uh, and I'll add salt at this stage because we haven't added salt so far and I'm just going to pulse it until it all comes together That's it, you saw I didn't grind it all over again because I don't want it to become a completely fine powder and I'm going to remove this onto the plate and uh, once it cools, I'll put it into an airtight container. So if you can see, there's a lot of crunch factor, the dal is ground more coarsely than the red chilli and the sesame seeds are again a different texture. So like I said, this is the advantage of making it at home. Uh, you can adjust the spice and the crunch. So do give it a try next time and tell me how you like it. Mm -hmm.